All right, everyone. It is me, Johnson Chan, and I went to bed really early yesterday, like 10, 10, 10, 20. Right? My body just was like, yeah, we really need sleep. So, you know, I woke up three times in the middle of the night last night, but I was able to basically power through my sleep. And you know, I got matches clock in about eight hours. Then I just woke up around 6 a.m., 6, well, 6, 20 a.m., and then I was lying in bed until 7. I was like, yeah, okay, I think I'm resting enough, so... Feeling relatively good. I just realized now that my sickness feels a lot better too, especially now that it's so much hotter. So hopefully I won't be catching any more damn germs. I don't even know where the hell I got it from, or maybe it was just simply just not getting up sleep for many days in a row. So anyway, uh, I had I didn't do any research at all, so except this. I mean, at this point, Joe Biden's going to win in a landslide, which is just hysterical to me. Um, and again, it's because. Trump is being fucking retarded. Like he should just—he's not—he's not, he's not uh, going for the white vote. He's just pandering to blacks that just hate his guts, right? Eighty-six percent are going to vote for Trump uh, for Joe Biden. You know, so. Oh well, eight years of Joe Biden. Uh, I mean, he himself is probably pretty chill, but the problem is, is the censorship's going to get so much worse. Um, and then, Democrats have made it made it pretty clear. Uh, the Democrat establishment has made it very clear that they don't like cryptocurrency. So it's going to it's going to be rough. It's going to be rough. So uh, I think I've gotten over the fact that, you know, Trump's going to get kicked out this year. And uh, I, I got to make a transition, you know, because because uh, I'm actually going to take a break from coding the game. Right. I mean, I haven't worked on it for two days now ever since you know, I was like, because like, uh, like it was just a, such a relief to finally get the per part of my game working. Uh, but I need to finish that infinite game book because I, I need some guidance, right? You know, so God's going to point me towards that. But then, you know, I'll be motivated to work on the game once, uh, you know, I finish reading the book. So hopefully another day or two. Because, uh, yeah, we're going to be needing some big changes. So, uh, yeah, but basically, um, I think one of the big reasons why, and I didn't even know, wasn't aware of this, is maybe the Democrats, for all their faults, play, play to stay in the game forever while the Republicans play to win, right? Because that's always how we were taught. Right, you play to win, you know. And it just sounds right, but then it turns out that like it's actually a massive fucking trap. So and it kind of sucks because I love to win, but on the other hand, there's no point. In, like even if you win, it's like, oh well, what happened? What do you do now? And on top of that, it's like, oh, you know, you're not always going to win. You're always going to get beaten. So it's about it's about playing the game, you know, and staying in the game forever. Right until you shuffle the mortal coil off and you 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 meet God and Jesus in heaven. Though of course now that um, SpaceX is working very well, we got the astronauts to space. Um, there's actually going to be like crazy new technology coming in, so we might actually become immortal, right? So uh, yeah, oh yeah, that's the interesting thing. My parents will be around at least another, I guess, ten, twenty, maybe thirty to forty years. Right, so, so my parents will be alive forever. Uh, yeah, well, I mean, I guess it's better that way. But yeah, you know, Jesus is gonna come back to to this galaxy, to Earth. So uh, yeah, because if we get to live forever, well, that is just naturally that just means our sins will have to gradually recede. All right, so it'll be a lot of interesting stuff to think about. So again, I didn't do any research, so let's just see what happened. Uh, Twelve interest for this week. Okay, not surprising. The normies are being stupid. Bitcoin down 64.9%. Twitter far by 89.5 billion. Bitcoin's at 80.9731. So it looks like it's stabilized after whatever it tanked. Litecoin's 47.47. Doggy coin. Doggy coin is 328.5 um, million market cap. Uh, 325 million market cap. Let's see. Oh, yeah, I was just thinking, like, uh, I was just thinking about crypto. So, uh, all right, just a lot of crap happening, and we'll get to four. I mean, there's nothing like 404. Uh, Crex is in the middle of the swap process, so you know, whenever they get done, they'll get done because they have, they have the new coins in their possession. And hold on, uh. Uh, what you might call it? Okay, uh, I was just getting something from Unity, um, from the Zenva course. Yeah, so they haven't responded back, so I assume they have everything that they need. So it'll be up whenever it's up. So hopefully, with, uh, hopefully within a couple days, because BTC, BTC pop 
got 404 coin up and running very quickly. Um, so hopefully correct will only take a couple days at most. And then I told them, yeah, as soon as you're done, everything checks out. Yeah, relist it immediately. Uh, so yeah, so it'll just be whatever, a uh, couple days, uh, hopefully. But they said it'll take up to 14 days. So today is June 4th, so 14 days after June 2nd. Uh, June 16th to June 18th, but it should take no, not anywhere near close to that. So we should be fine. Uh, Steam is at 20.66 cents, Hive's at 25 cents. Interesting. All right, so let's just open some of these. Actually, before, actually, before I get to the news, let's do the crypto first. Uh, let's see, JFT 7 8. All right, so uh, then 4 4 is obviously not listed yet because it's being swapped. Uh, two by two coins, 73 to 75, extremely rock solid. So, two by two coins should be all right for a while, especially now that I caught the uh, beginning of the bull run that's about to happen. It should be uh, pretty stable for a long time, actually. It should be pretty nice. Uh, so Dow Jones Industrial, uh, okay, so looks like markets are neutral, Remmel, oh wow, it's worth 353 now, it's, it's come a long way, it's come a long way since coronavirus. U.S. trade deficit wise as exports hit 10 year low, two charts impact, uh, reveal impact and social, arrest. Okay. I actually might be interested in this. Oh yeah, I forgot. I was supposed to uh, compound coin five thousand to fifty six hundred. All right, so that, there is that. So basically, crypto is solid. We are solid. It's just the waiting game. And now that four or four coins about to come back up online, new four or four. Uh, I'm actually going to be able to make some freaking money finally, right? Between two by two and four or four coin is GMC coin. I'm just I'm just waiting on that. So it's yeah, it's going to be good. It's going to be pretty good. It's going to be pretty good. Oh my god, it's actually pretty hot. Uh, hmm, all right. Uh, and this next, because I figure this thing is going to be basically the same thing as this, whatever. Tally trailers is on one insanely risky position. Okay, I don't want to read that. that. That's also why he's retarded. Because, first of all, when I see when I lost my 35 grand MRRL, I didn't put my whole thing in there. No, I was gradually putting it in, and then after a while, I was like, okay, I think we have enough. There, uh, this is exactly the reason why. All right. The name of the game is to just farm as much money as you can safely and then get out. The exception might be cryptocurrency because, you know, basically the only risk you have is it goes to zero, right? And it goes to zero. Why? Because developers have been in the project. Well, I'm not going to abandon it. Mitch will definitely not abandon it. So we're good there. And the compound coin guys have proven themselves very good. You know, they, they, they're still sticking with it. So, yeah. No, I guess dancing in the street. I don't care. Uh, let's have a cheers here over the market. Actually, I do want to read about this. This is from 20 years ago. Because there was a. Yeah, okay. All right, there we go. Uh, coronavirus. Uh, who didn't get government pay payment? Need to take action. Treasury says. Okay, well, I got my money. So, hey, I'll take the money. Uh, Zoom if I raise is 935 yield. Okay, so there's basically nothing new. So I'm guessing people are pricing in the fact that Joe Biden's going to become president. I mean, it's pretty obvious. Like, Joe is. This will actually probably be the thumbnail because this is pretty large. Because a lot of people don't want to, like. I, mean, I haven't been getting any flack for this, but people don't seem to want to admit this either. You know, so. Uh, blah, 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 we already talked about the swap, let's see, if there is become top on, I don't care, did their own thing in name, I was selling more of their Bitcoin, that may actually be, I actually want to know what the headline is, uh, that may actually be bullish, alright, that's, alright, I guess I'll read that, buyer, Bitcoin buyer, can I ignore this three, okay, uh, sudden so meltdown, okay, so the fact that they're recycling very old news and Google News tells me that there's not much happening. That's good. No news is good news. No news is always good news. Good news is always good news. And then bad news, uh, it depends. Is it priced into the market already or not? If it's already priced into the market, then bad news is not really that bad. So, uh, so basically, for the most part, things go very well. That's why cash flow is usually king. Right, and then you just have to make sure. Does it go to zero? In MRRL's case, the answer was yes, which is annoying because I lost thirty-five grand after all said and done, and two years. So that's the other thing too: two years at thirty-five grand. 
I got all my money back with uh, Region Financial and Remo mostly. Yeah, RF is already clock. It's already almost back to what it was. So I bought RF at like what eight, seven dollars a piece, something maybe even less than that. Now I'm already up a hundred percent. I mean, right now my stock market account is probably worth at least like thirty grand or whatever. So what? Uh, like I, I don't even care because yeah, it's gonna be worth one hundred fifteen grand. You know so. But yeah, you know, I mean, on the one hand, I want Trump to win re-election, but on the other hand, I'm just so fucking pissed at how his complete lack of empathy and, like, just the fact that he just abandons his supporters and he keeps listening to stupid F-word son-in-law. It's just like, you deserve to lose, you stupid fat fuck, right? And yes, he's getting, he's getting very fat. Like, it's like, I'm just pissed, all right? On one hand, like, I lost a lot, I gave up a lot for this stupid fat fuck, and then I, you know, took it up the ass, my best, ex-best friends left me and all that shit. But on the other hand, they also had flaws, too, so, I mean, I, w I was able to take a shit ton of little lemons and turn it into, like, a lemonade stand business. Actually, I just, like, a lemonade manufacturer, basically, right? So I came out really well, but it's like, I could have done it, at least, it's like, <sighs> so... I don't know, but there's gonna be new problems. So, but yeah, I'm definitely gonna make this a thumbnail. I'm gonna put in the title: Trump, uh, Joe Biden now beating Trump 10% uh, on predicted. Uh, in 10% landslide. It, it's just ridiculous. And we're gonna uh, take a look at what this idiot's saying on his Twitter. You know, I, I can see it right now. Trump's going to tweet tweet right up until he goes to jail, right? Because the what is it? The NYS, the SDNY. I forgot what it stands for. The Southern District of New York Attorney. I think that's what it stands for. SDNY. The SDNY folks despise and hate him with all their like souls. So they're going to like harass him forever. Now the good thing is Trump's going to start suing everybody else. So, and I think he's going to buy out uh, One American News Network as well. So it'll be interesting to see what happens with that. Of course, they'll just become another uh, shill for. Uh, the unnamed country in the Middle East that cannot be named or criticized, but Nick Fuentes and the Gorper Uprising will deal with that. Report reveals which countries really support the uh, uh, powerful Bitcoin crypto pro uh, uh, secretary, Hester Pierce, not secretary of SEC. So this is pretty good. Uh, we don't need to read this, but Hester Pierce has been super fucking cool with Bitcoin crypto. She's like really pro Bitcoin. So this is this is very good. So very, very good. Um, I don't want to read the whole article because we've got a bunch of shit to read and I want to keep this video like 20, 25 minutes so I could go back and play Hades Star. Uh, in fact, we're already full. Wow. Okay. All right, we'll just send them back. Uh, let's see. I just want to know how many people, like, how many people. Uh, uh, okay. Okay. I I just want to see how many people approved her to become her secretary. Oh, okay. So it's just Trump that whatever. Uh, crypto mob. Yeah, I don't see any. Yeah. Oh, set. It's nominated. Okay, so. Yeah, they'll probably. Yeah, she's she's kind of lefty. I think she. She doesn't come off as hostile towards conservatives, but I, don't, but I think she's kind of like a Democrat, right? So, yeah, I don't see any problem with her getting reelected. Mass problem in Los Angeles issues Bitcoin manifesto. People are opting out of the social guard. Trevor Noah and the of American society. Uh, I might be curious. I don't like Trevor Noah, but I do want to know what... Oh, my God, this thing is so fucking bad. Oh my God! Well, you this fire fuck. I I I I miss my brave, but I mean, my VPN doesn't work with it. Investigate train to Charlie to discard Bitcoin mining operation. <laughs> Who didn't have so much crap to go over? I would read that. Yeah, but yeah, my race. We uh, we're very cunning people. Very good. We're very efficient and uh, um, what's the word I'm looking for? Resourceful. Yes. You know. Funny enough, Americans uh, or else Americans used to be really good at that. Okay, just said my miner is out. Um, all right, so Joe Biden, let's see. So what is fat ass Trump doing? He's complaining about fake news terrorists. Uh, 
Do you had the other far German who was good? I asked for that. Yeah, right now Trump still play the I'm a huge asshole, and that's just not what people want to hear. They want to hear empathy and understanding. Um, and Republicans, they they're still in the play to win mindset, so that's why they're just gonna lose, you know. Um, and and now that Mike Cernovich and a few and Nick Fuentes are being negatively influenced by the fake right with all their fake Christianity, fake conservatism, and just negativity in general, yeah, I mean it, it's over. It's basically over. I I don't even want to read this shit. Uh, okay. The, he's gonna attack him on China. All right, this is this is legit pissing people off, including me. I mean, I'm not ultra pissed off, but I know this is just like everyone hates your guts, and they also accuse you of just being an actual racist, especially based on the way you've been behaving at the riots. And then now you're just like, oh, let's just blame China more. And it's like you just come off as like a stupid fucking. It's like you see, you see, you see. You know, we were right about Trump. He hates the Chinese. He hates the black. He hates all of us. Just vote for Joe Biden, right? You know, so, whatever, man, fuck. By the way, it's also stupid because obviously people seem to forget, like, just because you're not Chinese doesn't mean that you're immune to the rules of karma. It's very bad karma to attack Asians, particularly Chinese people. This is exactly why. So, you get what you deserve, right? You know, so. Of course, if I told people that, you know, especially the Groypers, they would just get very angry, so. All right, you learn the hard way, though. All right, so basically Trump is basically tweeting himself out of the White House, literally. Uh, shredding of the American society. It's a breakdown. Of, I'll also make sure I put that in the YouTube description. And because no one's supporting me and promoting me, well, well, except you guys, of course. You know, like the ten of you that watch. Oh, before before we mention that, yeah. Uh, almost 100% of the 404 coins have been swapped. So that means 404 coin is extremely active, which doesn't surprise me. So, yeah. Uh... Well, yeah, that means, uh, oh my god, which means, because uh, I want to rub my eyes, uh, so, so uh, yeah, that means it's very popular, it's very popular, so we're actually going to be pretty, so long term, basically the infinite game, we're, we're, we're set, we're set. To break down motion and an alarming new norms emerging, checkered by peaceful pro ongoing violent clashes, tear gas, blah, 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 okay. Uh, full American said me about by triggering when an employee of the company called to report out while it's fraud, but the phone call... A joy at the heads of the white police are doing a part of much room. Political turn Okay, all right. This, this start. This this fuck that are fucking are starting to read very G word. The impact of the new social unrest on the U.S. economy. Two charts. Um, so the unrest impact kind of real time. Uh, I only just want to just take a look at the pictures here. Um, our economic Twitter center fell amid social unrest. Uh, H have and men. You mentioned the coronavirus, have negative sentiment, don't mention the coronavirus. Uh, well, that makes sense, yeah. It's also one of the reasons why I just stopped using Twitter. Like, I mean, I'm still using it, but it's like, there's just too much negativity. I just, I just, like, I just can't stand it. It's like, all right, this is just too much. Uh, yes. Joe Biden is just going insane on Trump. So, all right. Consumer sentiment. Ah, uh, my eyes. Uh, but then it came sense of killing. I'm getting so sick and tired hearing this shit. Great job with Charles causation. Blah, blah, blah. It's hard to hear that we can consider over the past two weeks since you're really just already in a sharp recession due to coronavirus. I mean, they deliberately tanked the economy and it clearly worked, all right? Because uh, Trump is... Yeah, I mean it works. Like this is exactly what they wanted, and on top of it, they get a um, they get a, they get a they get martial law uh, implemented in America, right? And Trump has literally no choice but to send in the military. 
So, like, as we, it's like, basically, it's like chess. Trump thinks he's playing at, like, 2,900 GM Hakaru, but he's really at the, two, he's like a 1,200 player. It's basically, like, a new player, right? And then he's getting his ass kicked by the establishment that they are actually playing at, like, you know, Magnus, Magnum Carlsen, the world's best chess player, uh, level, which is, like, what, 20, yeah, 20, like, 2,981. I think, and then Hakaro was twenty eight eighty one. So I Hakaro actually beat Magnum Carlson. So yeah, I mean that's uh, that's that's what fucking happens. David Bowie's record labels dancing in the street. Uh, world's two biggest record labels have achieved this. We are with Valerie Bello Music. Warner Brothers leave behind label behind uh, IPO. Uh, by the way, is there stock? I want is there stock live yet? <clears throat> Undefined. Warner Music Group, thirty-one dollars and eighty-five cents. Wow, this shit's already up six dollars. Uh, blah blah blah. How do I get ready to develop more than a decade? I told me I seem to be so just the value of the issue is not the other. Okay, the strange giant step. Okay, here we go. Spotify essays 2018 IPO first hint at uh, streaming giant is now valid at 30 billion, even though it's unexpectedly profitable this year. The labels who take a generous cut from uh, by the far are getting in on the act. Universal Vivendi has all of the so called conglomerate discount in its own share. There are the music bit that are asking where being assessed at full work by investors as such cheap. CEOs been holding out the product of Universal Music IPO since 2017. The investor over the press bill boost, uh, boosted by the stake sale to Tencent has helped style for Francis benchmark CAC 40. Even now, the is only talking about an IPO by 2023. Uh, Pop and Warner shooting at the This column does not even reflect the bay of the editorial by the Bloomberg LP and its owners, Alex Webb. It's a blah, 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 blah. Okay. Well, there's de well I definitely need to get into the entertainment business. This is. Uh, this is this is pretty nice. It's like usually when you have an IPO, the stock price just tanks immediately. This is the first time in my entire life that I've actually seen an IPO, and then right after it's live for the open market, uh, it goes up in price by a lot. In this case, twenty five thirty one fifty is like to twenty. I don't know. It's like almost twenty five percent increase. Twenty. It's like a twenty percent increase. Twenty twenty to twenty two twenty one percent increase in price. That's that's quite a lot. Uh, Myers to sell this might be, I think I might have to turn on the uh, air conditioning. Um, let me see, weather, New York City. Oh, great. Oh, Australians use Celsius. What the hell, 77? Oh, it is there. Okay, so the high is 87 and 60, why is it saying 77? Oh my god, it's gonna be almost 90 degree weather today. Oh man, you know what? That means a protest is gonna be going insane right now. The biggest crypto by market value, uh, in less than five minutes during Tuesday's, the price drop hour, I've not deterred miners. Um, going to the data source, but by tree, miners are sold, 90 degree. We were a hold when the market is weak, not because they are bullish, because the market can't tell when they sell. When they can sell is indicating the market is well supported. Okay, the market series card exposed big seller duty higher coming will could be challenged because miners mainly operate on cash, meaning they need to look at their holdings almost daily to right. Uh, while they're the biggest price is prices, gyrish prices. Bitcoin is currently up six percent on a week at the press time, Bitcoin's changing hands at noon. Okay, so Alright, so it wasn't that much, but that's an interesting um, thing. I guess we could leave that there too. Uh, anyway, uh, so not much, so not much happening actually. So if you like what you saw, read or heard, hit the like button, the follow button, or subscribe button from wherever you're watching this from, or on my YouTube's at youtube.com forward slash JMC Radio. Make sure you smash that subscribe button on the right hand side of this page so to continue growing this channel. All right, so uh, things are going good personally, financially, politically. Uh, Republicans and Trump are going to be. Uh, worth dog shit. Uh, the problem is I think a lot of conservatives and Republicans in general still will not look at who really screwed this up. It's Trump screwed it up, Jared Kushner screwed it up, and the fake right screwed it up. And I assume, I think Mike Sarich is pretty good at 
deflecting blame. Uh, but I think eventually people are probably going to go after him too. But I'll, he'll, he'll probably be one of the last people uh, people go after. But by that, I mean it's already going to be too late. So uh, yeah, so it'll just be Nick Fuentes and the Gripper Uprising. Uh, we'll have to see because the Faker also seems to have this obsession with taking out China. So I don't know. I guess I'll have to deal with it in time. Yeah, you know? but I guess that's my destiny, right? Anyway, see you all in tomorrow's video. Thanks for watching. And 25 minutes, 10 seconds. Not bad. Judson Chan, JMC coin, 404 coin. Crex already has the 404 coin. They're just doing the swap as of right now. Uh, I have nothing. I'm going to refresh my Gmail and my Chrome. Yeah, they're already. So hopefully within a couple days at most. Because as soon as they're done, they will list. They'll relist it. It'll just be back to normal. So uh, the numbers. It'll, it'll just be like a stat squish from... Uh, uh, stat squish from uh, World of Warcraft. So right now in World of Warcraft, everyone's got like millions of hit points. It's like uh, I, I like it, but you know, whatever. Anyway, see you all tomorrow's video. Uh, no real news today.